Welcome to the AACS Daily News for October 21st, 2016. The Attleboro Arts Museum has launched their 25th annual Benefit Art Auction. Hundreds of pieces of art are up for bid, with all of the funds raised going to support the programs of the Arts Museum. To find out more, we spoke with Executive Director Mim Fawcett. I am standing in the Otmar Gallery and surrounded by 201 pieces that have been donated to our 25th annual Benefit Art Auction. Uh, this is our silver anniversary, so we're very excited to commemorate that milestone. Um, and we're also delighted with all of the donations that we have this year. The auction, in effect, has already begun, but the actual live and silent event takes place on November 5th. That's a Saturday. The doors open at 5 o'clock. We will have a social time, um, a time to view the artwork, a great buffet supplied by Russ Moore and Catering. And then at seven o'clock, the live auction will begin. We are going to be featuring, I believe it's close to 60 items in the live auction, and the remaining will be available all evening for bidding that night. The auction has really launched. So starting on uh, October 13th, the auction was online and all of the items are up there. Uh, if you go to biddingforgood.com slash Attleboro Arts Museum 2016, that URL will take you to our online auction. Uh, you will see that we have close to $3,000 worth of bids already, I'm happy to say, and it, again, it just opened up on the 13th. Folks can go in and place bids in advance of the actual auction. This is a very good time to start the action going and we're thrilled with the response already. It's been just a few days. Uh, there's also another way that you can pre-bid. The gallery is open with all of the auction items on display and folks come in, they take their time, they look at the work closely and as you can see next to every piece there's a bidding sheet and you can once registered fill in your paddle number and then you've placed a pre-bid. What happens with all pre-bids is that the night of the auction bidding starts from the highest pre-bid and then we go from there. We are thrilled to have so many beautiful pieces donated. It's quite a mix. It's work on canvas, work on paper, we have stained glass, we have beautiful ceramic work, we have blown glass, uh, we have textile, we have a vacation home, we have an autographed ball from Brock Holt from the Red Sox that was donated to us this year. Uh, we have really quite a mix, functional items as well. These are all original or limited edition pieces and that's the beauty of the auction. But the magic behind all of this is that the bidding begins at one third the value of the piece. So if a piece is listed at um, $150, the bidding will start at $50. And people come to the auction year after year knowing that that is the formula behind the bidding process. So you can easily end up with a very high value piece at a very reasonable price. What I would like to mention is that tickets for the auction are on sale now. The auction ticket price, which includes hors d'oeuvres and wine and beer, is $35 in advance and $40 at the door. All proceeds go to the museum. We are uh, highly dependent on the success of the auction. It's our major fundraiser for the year that fuels our exhibitions, our arts programs, our classes, materials for classes, uh, all of the events that we do during the year. So we really are grateful to the donors and grateful to the buyers as well. Um, you can go to the museum's website, which is www www.attleboroartsmuseum.org and you can read all about the auction. You can also get a link to our online site there where you can place pre-bids. We hope everyone comes down and views all of the pieces and um, supports the auction this year. That's it for today's update. For AACS News, I'm Austin Ricketts.